welcome back to Jesse at home today's video I'm going to be organizing the baby's nursery I'm super excited about it so come along and I'm gonna show you what I'm working with so after the baby shower we had separated into newborn and zero to three we have blankets and just a bunch of miscellaneous stuff those are the baby blankets from my previous kids so I'm gonna wash those I want to wash everything take tags off of everything that way he is ready to wear them when I want to wear them and organize them by size I'm gonna organize the dresser um, so first things first is unpackaging everything and then organizing to wash I want you more than my name I want to float on downstream Go and find my wild dreams, yeah I'd kill to feel it all shake You like a twisted mind game I'll be burned by your flame, oh Ups and downs, no in-between Fire and ice, burn gasoline You know I love it You know I love it Love and hate, romantic sin Fire and ice, gone with the wind If you are new here, my name is Jessie. I'm a stay-at-home mom of two teenagers, and this is baby number three. It's quite an age gap between my youngest um, teenager and this little baby boy, but we are all so excited to meet him in a few weeks. My husband and I just bought this house, and we have a ton of room makeovers if you love that sort of thing, and I do a lot of cleaning motivation, organization, and decluttering on this channel, so I would love it if you would hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my uploads. Okay, this is my newborn pile. Not too bad. I didn't go too overboard with the newborn, but remember, they were saying he was measuring small for so long. And I had to say, look at these little shoes. <laughs> look how cute those are. Um, and then this is my zero to three month pile. So I'm going to go ahead and get these washing. That way um, I can work on unboxing the rest of the stuff over here. Break my heart, just break free. Just let me see your bad streaks. Maybe they'll match my freaks. Yeah, I'd kill to see the stars cry. Roam in the dark while love hides. Let the world know you're mine. Oh, what? ups and downs, no in between. Fire and ice, burn gasoline. You know I love it. You know I love it. I am not gonna lie this was super tedious to cut all of those little plastic pieces off of all of the baby clothes I feel like each little piece of clothing and bib and blankets had about five or six of those little plastic pieces holding them together so they would look like cute on the hanger for the store but it was it took me a very long time to go through all these boxes all these clothes and get them ready to even be washed
One thing I was super happy about was the rug that we decided to put in here was super cozy on my legs and knees as I was sitting there and crawling around on it all day um, because I, that's one of the things I was worried about when we installed the laminate flooring in here is that I definitely wanted him to have a nice cozy spot to play on and, and you know have fun on and this rug definitely did its job with the rug pad underneath. I'm just using my method and the grapefruit scent to kind of clean up the inside of the dresser drawers and now I'm going to be organizing these um, and figure out what the best system is for the way I'm going to use the dresser. I did get some of those dresser dividers and a couple of those like soft organizers that I can put in there and I think by the end of it it turned out really really nice. Too much of I am going to do a little like tour to share with you the way I figured out what works best for um, everything. I did get everything on Amazon so I will link those in the description box if you're looking for them. Um, but the fun part was folding all of these little teeny onesies. I'm starting off with all the newborn clothes and then I'm going to put the um, zero to three month in the next door that way I know what's what and um, you know baby was measuring small for so long so like I said we have um, a couple newborn outfits but more zero to three than the newborn and then I actually just packed away his um, bigger sizes and then when he's ready for that size I will pack away um, and store the little sizes and kind of do a reverse thing where it's like the three to six month and then another drawer will be the six to nine month. So that's the way I'm going to do it instead of having all of his clothes in here um, at one time because it is a small room and I want it to be as functional as possible. So 
that you lied to me Now I keep thinking Was I wasting my time Letting you into my life You brought out the best in me We had everything we needed You put me aside and turn out the lights This room is listed as a nursery um, on the floor plans for when it was built, but it def definitely didn't have a closet, which I don't think most nurseries, like labeled nurseries, have closets. This adjoins our master bedroom, but also has a door open into the entryway. So my husband and I went to Ikea to buy this little wardrobe, and it fits perfect perfectly in here, and it's going to be wonderful for his little baby clothes. He's not staying in here forever. We also have... Um, two bedrooms upstairs and then also uh this like three room suite above the kitchen and garage it's like a bonus room my oldest son is in right now so um when my oldest son um decides that he wants to move out or go to college or like whatever he wants to do um and the baby is a little bit older two or three we will move him upstairs and um, he can have an actual closet and a playroom and things like that upstairs Since I am 38 weeks pregnant, this is the hardest part is just waiting to see and meet my sweet little boy. Um, I love looking at all these little clothes and imagining dressing him up in these little outfits. Um, boy clothes can be fun too. I like dressing up my little my little guys as like little men with like cute little um, polos and short sets and things like that. Um, I've never had a summer summer baby. Um, newborn my daughter was born in December so she was around six months um, during her first summer my son was born in April so he was around three months when summer began so they were a little bit more sturdy a little bit more chunky <laughs> for this summer so this is gonna be my first little newborn baby for this summer and I just can't wait to relax and enjoy spending time with him um, hang out at our pool and just have a nice wonderful um, time off also with my older kids they get to spend a lot of time with him as well it's just going to be a wonderful um, summer this year
I had gotten those little plastic pieces all over the carpet so I'm just using my little Hoover um, Evolve pet vacuum and this thing is great it's so lightweight um, which is nice to have especially this far along in pregnancy not having to like push heavy machinery across the carpet and it does a great job of picking up um, one carpet or hardwood floors I love this little thing I may or may not have bought way too many receiving blankets and extra crib sheets and um, changing changing table pads, uh, cover pads, but I used the heck out of them and I just couldn't help myself with all the cute little like star themed patterns. I When I go with a theme, I go a little crazy. So everything that I picked out myself is um, space inspired or star, you know, like constellations and things like that. I just wanted to add on here that um, I am going to be doing baby watch and a birth vlog and all that fun stuff over on my vlog channel, Jessie on the go. So we'll leave that linked in the description box below if you'd like to follow along for that. I know some people like vlogs and things like that, so I just kind of keep that over on that channel. Um, and of course, follow me on Instagram for like in the moment up to date um, updates on baby watch. So here is the finished product of this little snug -a puppy bouncer. I am not putting batteries in it until he actually gets here and we use it. That way the batteries just don't aren't sitting in there. But I'm not gonna lie, this thing was kind of a pain in the butt to put together. I don't know if it's because I was just sitting on the floor or what, but I had to look up instructions. The instructions weren't with it. So I had to look on my phone to see what was going on. But super cute little vibrating bouncer chair. 
guys we're getting closer and closer so this is my little tour so we have the diaper pail refills here this is burp cloths um, binky holders in this little section newborn diapers um, diaper rash and the little diaper rash spatula some wipes in the top drawer right here because changing table easy access over here this is my newborn drawer so we have all the newborn onesies we have the newborn gowns and sleepers and a uh, swaddle we have oh here are the sleepers back here um put pajamas for newborn and then a ton of gowns because i really like gowns on um newborns and then a swaddle and then all his little socks aren't these so cute i've already lost one sock i have no idea where the other red one is but look these look like little shoes how cute is that in this drawer is all the zero to three so here's all the zero to three like plain onesies that go under things these are like ray done stuff with words on it these are the printed onesies these are the footed sleepers and these are all the zero to three gowns and this one is all of my receiving blankets i use these a lot for like everything so i kind of went buck wild and got a ton of ones when i realized i didn't have any i just went on amazon and ordered a couple packs i just didn't realize how many were in each pack so i have a ton of these swaddles but i use these for a very very long time for a lot of different things so i'm not too fussed about having a full drawer of um receiving blankets down here is just going to be extra wipes for now um I don't I have boxes of wipes as well but these are just like the individual packages over here I did that one down on this bottom is extra crib sheet extra changing pad cover and then my muslin swaddles um, so these are just like the nicer swaddles that aren't like the zip up or the wrap kind so You'll just have these in here for like pictures or something nice or just something to have to like lightly lay over him or something. I'm not sure, but I have three of those. And then in his little Ikea closet here, wardrobe, up top I have these little like shoes. This goes with an outfit. <laughs> this is just so stinking cute. These little, little like baby shoes. I have some swim diapers and a swim outfit. Um, I have some more of those hangers, um, baby milestone block, and his like little letter board, and then of course all of his clothes. These are like outfit clothes, so um, these are newborn right here because we don't know how big he's going to be. So these are the newborn um, outfits. So we have a little crab guy, he has the pants with it. Then we have like a little short set, short and shirt set. And then we have these cute little rompers for the 4th of July. And then just some cute little, just little boy outfits that I've picked up here and there. I just love it, I think it's so cute. And then this section is the zero to three month. So again, we have cute little rompers and just some solid little outfits. I love overalls on a baby. And then my husband picked this outfit out and I thought it was so cute, just like a little, I don't know, like a seersucker little outfit. And then here is a nice short and shirt set. And then another little short and shirt set. And then just a long sleeve um, onesie. So, this is all the clothes he has until we figure out how big he is and then obviously we can buy more. Down here has nothing in it, but I'm currently washing his blankets and a lot of them are the Sherpa stuff. And this is where his extra blankets are gonna go along with over there in that little basket. But I don't want the Sherpas to be um, in the dryer so that they get all weird and fuzzy so they're hang drying so if you're new 
to my channel this is the nursery I have a whole nursery makeover video on my channel in case you missed it and I tell you exactly where I get everything the whole process of making this room into a space themed galaxy room so I will link that up in the cards so that you can check that out if you want to that way you can um, know where everything came from I have all the links over there so this is his little nursery and I love it Cause every time